Hi Scorpio. All right, so it's L here to do your 72-hour energy reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and get into this. Thank you, God, for blessing Scorpio with a clear, concise message. I see. I'm saying Scorpio. This reading is for Gemini. I'm saying Scorpio because. Uh, there's a lot of Scorpio energy in here. So it's like um, the good and the bad. Trying to really come to some conclusion about a relationship. There's a lot of mystery surrounding somebody. You don't know if somebody's telling the truth. Somebody is lying, okay? Somebody is lying, okay? And they're lying to everyone, okay? Someone could be lying to everyone about maybe their... um sexual orientation what sex they really like you know if it's male or female okay also there's just somebody lying in terms of if they really want to work on the marriage or the connection we have a yes and we have a no um someone may even say that they want to work on it but they really mean no someone could say um yes they want to work no they don't want to work on it but they really mean yes so it could be vice versa um, Gemini, you could be dating, okay? You could be going out, meeting people. You could actually meet someone who's worthwhile. You could meet a twin flame, okay? Somebody who really kind of has your same energy. Someone that you could um, see yourself with, okay? Um, something about expectation. I don't know if you're expecting for this person to disappoint you. You've got to get over something from the past, Okay, something that, you know, is a personal issue for you. You need to come to some type of resolution about that. It has something to do with family, um, you, self-care, really kind of acknowledging your thought process. And is it, are you thinking correctly about things? Are you handling situations in the right manner? Are you nice is what I'm hearing. Some of you just aren't nice. Um, and it, it could be due to external factors you have nothing to be nice about um again you could be meeting someone who you're supposed to meet it could be karmic okay so do understand that that maybe this person you know um is brought into your life for a reason maybe for spiritual growth here you could be waiting for someone to communicate with you you already know that what they're going to say to you is lies they're not telling the truth um they could be dating several people or you're dating several people. Somebody has lots of strings, lots of keys on a ring. You know, they, they date several people. They talk to a lot of people. Someone's not willing to work on the marriage because they're out dating also. Um, they understand who that person, that marital partner is to them. But at the same time, they don't want to fix this. Okay. Uh, and it may be because they have personal issues. Again, someone is saying yes when they mean no. Someone is saying no when they mean yes. Someone is expecting your call, Gemini, or you're expecting someone else's. If you're dealing with a Scorpio, they're lying, okay? They're just outright lying. Um, there could be another woman, another man involved in this connection. Um, somebody finds it easy to lie to you via, uh, you know, text or written word, you know, email text message, whatever. Uh, they find it real easy just to kind of put you off or tell you a lie or put you in a place where um, kind of pacify you is what I'm hearing. There's so much mystery surrounding this person and they keep you in the dark. They keep you in a place of confusion because they know in confusion you won't make a decision. So this is what I have for you, Gemini. I hope that it resonates for you. Go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link. Thank you, Gemini. Many blessings to you.